chainsaw has entered the building and all fear has entered my body. Chainsaw being led to the ring by her younger sister, Angelica Dante. All right, uh, uh, nope, nope, I don't want any, nope. Sorry fans, I just had a chill go down my spine. Chainsaw looked me in the eyes and I've never felt pure terror such as that. Angelica Dante, the younger sister, leading Chainsaw to the ring. Angelica Dante has been the spark under Chainsaw that she's needed. Chainsaw has been on a rampage, a warpath, and now she's meeting her toughest challenge in the Beast. Well, this is our opening match, fans, for tonight. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Introducing first, accompanied to the ring by her little sister, Angelica. Chainsaw, managed by her little sister. Fans have been waiting for this for some time. Here she is, David, the juggernaut of WOW, the unbeatable, the biggest, the baddest. She is the beast. And this is her first return to the WOW ring since that tibia break and ankle break some time ago. The beast is back and the beast is methodically coming after the person that injured her. And we don't know who the assailant was. Could it have been Chainsaw? We don't know. The beast leaps into the ring. I'm not one to point fingers, but that definitely seems like something Angelica Dante and Chainsaw would have done. Eddie Burt, the referee. Lauren Hunkley gonna make the official announcement here. Making her first return to the ring after her devastating injury from the deepest depths of your mind, the Beast! The Beast is laser focused. And I hate to be a buzzkill, but one's gotta wonder what is that tibia ready for? Is that leg ready for a match like this? The Beast just chucks right in, out of the frying pan, into the fire, and she's in there with Chainsaw. One of the biggest, one of the most intimidatingly physical opponents that the Beast has ever set foot in the ring with. These two lock up, and this is definitely gonna be a challenge for the Beast. She'll know right away if that leg is ready for combat against somebody like Chainsaw. What happens if Chainsaw falls on it? That's exactly my point, David. What if Chainsaw finds a way to re-injure that leg? The Beast just fought out of a full Nelson from Chainsaw. I'd say she's fired up and ready for this. That could be heard all the way in the cheap seats. The Beast fires off a clothesline. Chainsaw's off of her feet. Chainsaw's off of her feet. We've never seen Chainsaw take it off her legs that quickly. There she is, she just went for the leg. Now she's going in for the choke. Slamming the Beast, we've never seen anyone do that. The Beast comeback could be derailed instantly. The Beast just forces Chainsaw into the corner. There's the power of the Beast, the power, the strength. David, I'm pretty sure the ring was about to move. It did move. Look at the look in the Beast's eyes. Chainsaw doesn't know what day of the week it is. That may not be new for her, though. Oh, my, the Beast is back in full force. Did you see her leap into Chainsaw? She almost leapt right over the top rope. Have you ever seen her move like this, David? She hasn't had a spring in her feet like that ever before. The Beast is stalking Chainsaw. She's stalking Chainsaw. There it is, Spear! 